Our Defenders team is digging further into a child sex abuse investigation of the Catholic Church. The names of more than 40 clergy members credibly accused of sexually abusing children before, during, or after their time in the Diocese of Charlotte are now public. But our Defenders team was alerted to one name that wasn't on that list, a former Belmont Abbey administrator accused of abusing kids in Minnesota and New York. Our Nathan Morbido joins us with a closer look at those allegations and why the Diocese of Charlotte wouldn't be the one to name them. Nate? Those cases are from other parts of the country. The Diocese of Charlotte says there's no record that this priest ever served in any church, ministry, or school in the Diocese of Charlotte or under its supervision. That's why he wasn't named in the diocese list. But why hasn't Belmont Abbey named him? Father Timothy Kelly, a member of the Benedictine Order. They all tell exactly the same story. A longtime priest with several alleged victims. He did the exact same pattern of behavior. The classic crime of solicitation for sex in, in the confessional. A man former monk Patrick Wall knew well from his time at St. John's Abbey in Minnesota. He essentially was my superior. In the years since, Wall left the priesthood, frustrated by the culture of sex abuse. He's now an advocate. Father Timothy Kelly. For attorney Jeff Anderson's firm. The firm's filed lawsuits naming Kelly, including a pending case out of New York filed just last year on behalf of John Doe. In 1965. Here's a statement Anderson read from the unnamed victim. I was sexually abused by Father Timothy Kelly at St. Anselm's Church of the Bronx, New York. Almost 25 years later, he was in your area for at least three years. Kelly moved to Belmont Abbey as an administrator. He was a priest. He was ministering to the people of North Carolina, and he was in charge of many monks who were functioning as priests in uh, Diocese of Charlotte. Still, church officials say they only named clergy members who served in Diocese of Charlotte churches or under the diocese supervision. This bishop controls his diocese, but the religious community has their own superiors that control their personnel. The Benedictine Order is in charge in Kelly's case. Belmont Abbey's only named a couple monks linked to sex abuse, both last year. One of the allegations local, but neither one was Father Timothy Kelly, who just a short time after leaving Belmont Abbey, went on to help create a sexual trauma institute for victims and perpetrators of clergy sex abuse. He died in 2010. A Belmont Abbey spokesperson said the Abbey has not received any kind of allegations against Father Kelly, ever. St. John's Abbey in Minnesota, where he worked most of the time, in a response to this lawsuit in New York, denied the allegations of sexual abuse and did not put this priest's name on its list of credibly accused clergy. Nathan Morabito, NBC Charlotte.